Okay, so I walked into a store here that sells beauty supplies, which I had vowed I wasn't going to go in again because I felt that a lot of the products seemed to have fallen, uh, you know, been have fallen off a truck. And by that, I mean that you could get home, you could purchase products from there, get home. The products are separated, it's smelled, it's rancid, it's over and over again. But I realized they've changed hands, although that doesn't mean anything. And I walked in looking for something else and ended up seeing these products. And I decided to try them because I always feel that, you know, you can never have enough moisturizers. And what I realized is that um, these two products, Soft and Free and Reverend Realistic, I know them from the past as products that catered at, at one time in the 80s, I should say, um, jerry curls, curl activator type products, you know, I never used them. I think I may have used their gel here, but it was nice to see. First of all, I like the, the size. This is three. It's, um, a hundred mils extra, which I didn't realize. I just like the size. And my thing is I've decided that I'm going to be buying products that cater to the relaxed girl's hair because I feel those products are packed with moisture. Yes, silicones. So those of you who don't like silicones, read up on your silicones and know why you don't like them. Not because the world says they are bad because it's not always the truth. It's sometimes these things are just based on one study that has nothing to do with hair. I'm not going to get into that, but do your own research. So anyway, I like the fact that it was catering to the relaxed girls. It did say black castor oil, but if you read the ingredients, castor oil is way down here. And before it, you have the so many other things above it. So you know that it's not, it's not filled with castor oil. There's some of it, a little bit, a good amount in it, but not as much as if it was up here, right? But that didn't bother me. I just like the fact that it was so there was so much in it so it's like 350 mils mils if i'm not mistaken yes 350 mils right and these are all these are 250 and, and my thing is they're probably doing that because of the relaxed girl's hair now very long you know um, requires a lot so i'm happy about this this i like the fact that it said baobab oil but trust me baobab is one of the last ingredients and above it is other stuff macadamia shea butter and you wonder why they're they're, they're pushing baobab but i i just chose it i like the packaging i like the orange i like the fact it's a baobab oil i really didn't care whether it was or not and i thought it was worth a try i'm always um trying out products now these two products are made by a company called m and m products and i believe they were established in 1973 and they were known for the soft and free line, the Stay Soft Fro product. That is where they became a household name. So sometimes it's just great to, to read up on your products, the history, the company behind them. Black Velvet is by a, co a company called Tropical Eden and I believe they're based in South Africa. And they are known for their, they make chemi their chemical manufacturer. So they have um, hair, skin care, body care products, and there must be other products that they sell. I, they mention on their website that they have been um, uh, taking care of clients since for the last 10 years. But I, I don't know if I saw some way that they started in 1983. I may be wrong. I may be wrong. But 10 years ago is good enough. And um, I'm just willing to, to try their products. They have other products in this line. This is the retail product uh, line. And then they have the professional. It's just worth a try. I already tried this. But I'm going to try it again on freshly washed hair. To see how I feel about it. But... I love the fact that it was moisturizing without being oily and without being wet, like with water. You know that feeling. Your hair's not going to really shrink or anything. Sometimes you just want your hair to be moisturized and the style remains the same instead of changing shape and size and length and all that. 
So these are three products I will be trying and I will review them individually and um, enjoy. I forgot to add that MNN products that makes the uh, Reverend Realistic and Soft and Free is based in Atlanta, Georgia in the United States and it does have distributors in South Africa and England and probably show elsewhere so they produce those products here.